a poem in which my severed head speaks. When I say I got bored with hero, that means I got bored with God too. After years of praying, God reached their hands into me and gift me the love I can never give myself. I got bored with God, stopped praying they showed up, started searching for where my prayers went since they went unanswered, found nothing but a river full of death and mud, sticks and blood, got on my knees, leaned into it. Once my lips touched the water, the water took my head under and kept it, kept it so long, my body gained its own consciousness, its own language, said to me that if diamonds sharpen diamonds, then it must be the same for prayer, and my body got to moving like a blacksmith, sharpened prayer to something that could separate itself free from this lonely head, and left me like any country would a useless God. I can't blame my body for wanting sovereignty, for wanting more than the pattern of rain to call friend. I mean, here I am, singing like ain't no God, just this river music, filling my eyes, making me cry the lyrics. Everybody wants to go to heaven, but nobody wants to die. Coincidence. Alone, I say, I am nobody. Alone, I say, I want to die. And ain't no company here to tell me otherwise. See what I mean? Me being bored with God is me being left with my lonely, left with my depression so long. The only God I want to show up is my body. The only God I want is the one that can pull me out of this river and make me whole again. My body is learning how to feel. My body is calling everything it touches God. My body isn't bored anymore. I want to feel God in my hands. I want to glide my fingers across the tree's long chest, catch its pulse, and learn the ultimate prayer, calling oneself home. What use is the house of God if you can't feel God in everything that fills the house? I want my body back. I want every step I take to make me a stained glass testimony. The severed head that never found God in the dead river of his lonely, but found God in the holy of his body, called himself a church, welcomed all of his empty parts and said, here, I am loved. Here, I am cared for. Here, I am together. Here, I will never be alone.